Well, hello there. As you might have seen from the title, yes, we are in Amsterdam and we are here for the next two days. So it's going to be super fun. We have a few restaurants that uh, we need to check out and yeah, just explore the city, maybe go to a few museums and just soak in the beauty of the city. But first things first, it's almost noon, so I got to grab something to eat. And uh, for that, uh, I'm trying out a famous uh, pancake restaurant. So Dutch pancakes are quite famous. And that's why we are heading right now to a restaurant known as Pancake Bakery. So yeah, see you guys there. So I ordered this cup of latte macchiato and uh, they gave me a super cute small uh, stew waffle packet which is actually a specialty of uh, Amsterdam and Netherlands. So yeah, stew waffle with my latte macchiato. I don't think it's visible right now, but I am at the Zonse Shons village. It, it's it's a windmill farm with some cheese factories as well. And that's what I'm going to explore because I came here around three years ago, 2019, and it was beautiful. So I just wanted to check it out again. The weather right now is a bit strange. I think it's going to rain uh, at around like in about an hour or so, but I don't know. Let's see. So obviously it's not visible from here right now. But yeah, that's where I'm going around the windmills. Yeah, I think the windmills are still visible. Yeah, so I'll see you guys when I get there. So beautiful and peaceful out here that I could just spend my entire evening here. I mean, just look at this. Unfortunately, since I was late, most of the houses are now closed. There's a couple of them open, so I just visited them. I think there were like stroop waffles and everything, but not the main, the cheese one that I was looking for. That's closed. But yeah, other than that, it's a definitely a must visit if you're coming to Amsterdam. And the entry is actually free. I thought the entry is 5 euros, but the entry is actually free. You can just roam around the entire village, the entire area, check out all the houses. But if you want like a guided tour, then yeah, that's that costs somewhere around 10, 12, I don't know, not 10, 12 euros. But yeah, other than that, it's free. It's just so beautiful.
so okay it's the last day in amsterdam i have a couple of hours more and then i'll be going back home to paris and today i think we're going to explore uh, a couple of museums here and there yesterday the trip was cut short because it started raining in the evening so i could just do the central area plus um, the sonche sons in the evening but yeah i think today it's sunny so it's quite a good day and let's see right now i'm heading to the van gogh museum that that area and maybe after that i'll go again to the central area and just chill out for a little bit so i'll see you guys in the museum Okay, so I'm done with the Rix Museum. Unfortunately, I didn't have tickets for the Van Gogh Museum, which is right here, so I couldn't go inside. So the time that I'm saving, I'm just chilling out here in the park in front of the Rix Museum. Just yeah, grabbing something to eat, quick drink or something, and then maybe I'll go towards the central dam area. Ooh, quite a sunny day. Hi, uh, one small with small one? Yeah, small with uh, tartar sauce and mannequin piss sauce. Five twenty. Uh, tartar sauce and mannequin piss sauce. Which one? So we have come now to the. Please believe it or not. I hope it turns out to be good. Last time I was here, I went to Madame Prasad's, so that's why I'm not visiting that. But yeah, this seems to be a good spot. Let's see. Let's explore this. Mm -hmm. 